Hello there, YouTube. Tiddly Winks is here. The Senate is not budging on background checks. Wow, what good news. Anyway, I don't really report good news too often, so this seems to be some good news. But they've been asking senators, all of them who voted for background checks seem to still want to vote for them. All of them who voted against them still are going to vote against them. So basically, even after the tragedy in Washington, they're not going to pass the background checks. That does not mean we should not write our congressmen because we know that these guys will do anything for money and power and they could care less about their constituents, at least most of them. So start writing them now, letting them know we'll get them out of power and get them out of money real quick if we have to. Another thing I wanted to talk about, guys, is since the AR-15s kind of faded out of this story and they're finding out that the pump shotgun might have been used more than the AR-15 in this tragedy, they are now saying that we should demonize the pump shotgun in the media, which is kind of funny. After Joe Biden said, you don't need an AR-15, buy a shotgun. Buy a shotgun. <laughs> well, now we all got shotguns, and there's people killing people with shotguns. Pretty amazing how people kill people regardless of what the weapon is. They just have the intent to kill people. They're going to kill people. They're psychopaths. There's nothing we can do about it. Write your congressman before it's too late. Liberty or death. Don't tread on us. Tiddly Winks is signing off.